Hey, what's going on, guys? My name's CJ. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of these awesome videos. If you're back again, thanks so much. I really appreciate it. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to download, translate, and upload a subtitle file, also known as SRT file, to your YouTube videos for viewers on your channel who speak a different language so they can read the subtitles in their native language as they watch your video. Now, in the last video I made, I showed you how to watch subtitles on YouTube videos in different languages. The problem is that not every video will have this option. So it is important to upload the SRT or subtitle file to your YouTube videos to help your viewer read subtitles in their native language. This is really easy to do. Pay attention. Here we go. All right. So you want to go to this website here. It's called vidpaul.com slash subtitle dash downloading. There is no charge to download subtitles. And now what you want to do is go to one of your videos that you want to download the subtitles for translate. This is one of my videos called Google AdSense payment not received. So we're going to copy the URL at the top right. Just click on it. It should copy. If not, drag and copy. Right click, hit copy. Go to where it says VidPaul download subtitle. I'll put the link in the description for you guys. Right click and paste. After that, it takes you down to here and it says auto generated closed captions. You don't even have to hit the download, it downloads automatically. If you want to, you can. Other than that, just go down to where it says auto generated closed captions. Click on more. Now this website translates your subtitles into any of these languages listed below. Now I'm gonna go with Hindi. People from India generally watch my YouTube videos and Hindi is the language that they speak. So I'm gonna click on download. Now here I'm gonna click on the file that I downloaded which should go to my downloads folder on your computer. Okay, now here it is in Notepad. It has the timestamps and this is called an SRT file. Now, if you want to check the accuracy of the language, you can just copy some of this text, highlight it, copy it, open a new tab and type in Google Translate. Okay, in Google Translate, right click into the box here, it says detect language, right click and paste that language in here. Okay, as you see, it says it detected Hindi, which is right. And on the right, it says, What's up guys, it's CJ, and if you're like me, earning money on YouTube and you get paid from Google AdSense, okay, cool. This is 100% legit. It translated into the right language. Don't worry about the timestamps, that's supposed to be like that. Okay, now you wanna go back to your video and click on that blue edit video button. Now go down to the left where it says subtitles. Okay, if I scroll down, TubeBuddy is telling me the top 10 languages spoken by your channel's audience. English, Hindi being the first foreign language, 10%, Filipino, Spanish, German, Portuguese, and so forth. Now this pertains to my whole channel, but that doesn't apply to each individual video. If you wanna know the languages spoken by your audience for each video, you can just go ahead and click on analytics within the video. Go to where it says audience at the top, click on that, scroll down, and here it says top countries, United States and India. Okay, so that is right. 5% of people, 5% of people from India are watching this video. So that tells me I should be uploading the subtitle file in Hindi for people from India. So now I'm gonna go back to subtitles and I'm gonna click on add language. Click this blue button, add language. Scroll down to Hindi. One little trick I want to show you, if you're not familiar with the country's language, you could say on Google, what language do most people speak in India? And as you see, Hindi, 43.63%, almost half of people are speaking Hindi in India. Second is Bengali. Third is Maritha. Okay, so go with Hindi for India. Can you add Bengali and Maritha? Sure you can, but it's more work. I would go with Hindi. All right, so now we selected Hindi. We're going to title and description. We're gonna add this in. And this is an awesome feature that TubeBuddy has. 
only with the legend version. I can simply click on the translate button and it will translate the Hindi title and description for me. I'm going to click on publish for that. If you're interested in TubeBuddy at all, I'll put the link in the description. TubeBuddy is a great thing to have for your YouTube videos. Now for subtitles, we're going to go to where it says add. Because we have the SRT file, now we want to upload it. Go up to here where it says upload a file. Click on that. It says upload a text transcript or time subtitles file. Uploading will overwrite the version of Hindi. That's fine. Click choose file. Now you want to click on your SRT file for this video in Hindi. Double click. Here it is. Now it's ready to go. Just click on upload. Okay, as you see, it's in Hindi. If you wanted to check it, you can just go ahead and hit play. And as you see, the words are coming up in Hindi. All right, so now you want to hit publish. Okay, so English and Hindi subtitles are on this video. Now there's this thing called community contributions. YouTube is actually disabling this community contributions feature where people could contribute subtitles for videos. But the problem is a lot of people were spamming, doing other things. So as of today, YouTube will no longer allow community contributions. So you will have to upload your own subtitles file for your own videos. You won't be able to do that for other channels' videos. Now what I want to show you back on the channel, if I scroll down on my channel, go down to where it says Google AdSense, right here, you see the CC? This CC means closed captions. That means that there are subtitles in a different language for people to watch. That's why you don't see them on any other videos. That's when you see that CC, that's exactly what that means. Closed caption, it's subtitles, okay? That means there's subtitles in different languages. Okay, so now I'm going to check the subtitles on my video, make sure the Hindi is actually on again. I click on CC. It shows up in English, and I click on that wheel icon, click on subtitles, and there it is. Hindi is there, and as you see, it's right here. Now, again, in my last video that I showed, I showed you that you can watch subtitles in any language for most videos on YouTube when the person is speaking, like my video. By doing that, you click on auto translate, and now I can pick any language that I want, and it comes up. Now the problem is not every video will give you this option to select different languages from the auto translate feature. And the reason is because there might not be a person speaking. It could be a video game or it might be live stream. With live streams, you can't watch subtitles. There are some videos where you won't get this option to watch subtitles, okay? So again, it's up to you if you wanna do it. It will help the viewer read subtitles in their language it's not going to help your video get found it's just going to help the viewer understand what you're saying to help your video get found is exactly what i showed you earlier where you translate the title descriptions and the tags you can also do that translate the tags and that also will help your video get found in the native language that your viewer speaks i hope you like this video please like subscribe and comment and i'll see you in the next one peace